today we're using Laura Geller, Blushing and Blissful. And we're going to start with, mm, yeah, Glee for the crease area. So how's your Monday going? Last night I went to start painting the walls in my room that I needed to get done and um, I went and I did the, the top part of the wall first and I was stepping down off the stepping stool and my paint tray that I had in my hand decided that that was the perfect time to fly out of my hand, land in the corner, and all along the baseline. So that was fun. It was really hard to clean up because being in the corner, you know, you can't really get things into the corner and along the baseline to get it. I wanted to use my big steam machine because that usually works pretty good but the last time I used it the bar wasn't turning and the last time that that happened I thought it was the belt so I ordered belts and it wasn't the belt so I had taken it apart and I put it back together and it turned out to be something so simple and easy that had absolutely nothing to do with what you think it would but I can't remember what it was. <laughs> so I had to get the Bissell green machine, little green machine out and boy, that was fun. It didn't do a very good job either. So I got to figure out what's going on with the other one. And get that situated. <laughs> so after that, I decided I'm just going to come in here and rearrange the room. Okay, we're going to use Pleasant for the lid. I wanted to move the room around because it bugs me that there's, um, you know, no steady background. Because my babies do not like the door closed with mom behind it, so... I moved it back near this wall. The only thing, the lighting is really hard to get here. So might be a little bit off until I can figure it all out. This painting, the pink fairy, it's a fairy that my mom painted. That was her first and only fairy she painted. She wanted to do something for my birthday, you know, something really special. And so she painted that and I love it. Okay, we're gonna use Timid for outer corner and crease. She, um, she was a landscape and ocean painter. She loved the ocean and water. She was an Aquarius, so I guess that makes sense. Take it into your crease a bit. Okay. I think I'm going to put a little bit of a beat on the lid. I think I might have done that over here and forgot. 
There we go. Okay, where are we at? Five. Like, really hard to get lighting in this. I might have to move it closer to the window. Okay. I'm going to use Lorella Jewels Don't Fall <laughs> Highlighter. Stu, what are you doing? You be a good boy. Get my wipe. Clean up the edge. And get a fluffier brush and blend. I'll do that. I'm using e.l.f. Midnight Liner. Like that's really wet and I put more on than I meant to. gonna take a minute I'll be back okay I put Maybelline colossal classic black mascara on my top lash line now we're gonna use timid for the lower lash line it is a nasty day out there today just windy and yucky I'm going to do my bottom lash line and finish and I'll be back. Okay, we used Laura Geller Blushing and Blissful. Maybelline Colossal Mascara, Classic Black. Maybelline Truffle Tease Lipstick. Maybelline Tattoo Studio 36H Brow Pencil. A Revolution Super Serum F2 Foundation, Elf Midnight Liner, Elf Bright Pink Blush, Lorella Jewels Highlighter. Okay, I believe that is. Did I do this Elf Bronzer Palette? <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, here's your closer look. I moved lighting around a bit, but I don't I don't think it helped much. <laughs> um Yeah, this is going to drive me crazy. I'm going to have to work on the lighting sometime. Tomorrow I have to run some errands and stuff. But hopefully I'll be on. Um, what is it? Oh, Tuesday, huh? Yeah. Um, well, I hope you have a good rest of your day. And I will see you soon. Bye.